Hey everyone, in this video, I'm going to demonstrate finding average variable costs. So that's AVC from a total cost function. So total cost is TC. Now in the example that I have here, our total cost function is equal to 1,250 plus 3Q squared plus 50Q. Now our formula for average variable costs is, well, we take our variable costs, that's VC, and we divide variable costs by the quantity that the firm produces Q. Now our variable costs will be equal to that part of total costs that varies or changes when our quantity changes. And so this means that we're looking for any part of our total cost function that has a Q variable attached to it. In our example, that's going to be equal to this section here, 3Q squared plus 50Q. So variable costs is equal to 3Q squared plus 50Q. We can then substitute this into our formula for average variable costs, and I get 3Q squared plus 50Q all divided by Q, which is equal to, well, 3Q squared divided by Q is 3Q, and 50Q divided by Q is 50, so that's our average variable costs, 3Q plus 50. Now the other part of our total cost function is the fixed cost component, and that doesn't have any quantity variable attached to it. So in our example, it's just equal to 1,250. Now the reason why I mentioned this is because you might get an example of a total cost function where there is no variable cost component. So there is no Q anywhere in the function, in which case our variable cost will be equal to zero, our average variable cost will also be equal to zero and total costs will just be equal to fixed cost, so FC. You might also get an example where there is no fixed cost component to total cost, in which case total cost will be equal to variable costs and average variable cost would actually be equal to average total cost, which we find by dividing total cost by quantity. All right, that's it. That's finding average variable costs from a total cost function. I hope that it helped. If it did, please like and subscribe. Hope you guys are keeping safe and happy.